Chelsea need to balance their books. So, where have they decided to cut costs? And what decision has fans calling them penny pinchers? Let's find out. Before Clear Lake Capital's takeover, Chelsea were averaging a loss of £900,000 a week during Roman Abramovich's 19-year reign. As such, financial sustainability has become a greater priority for the new owners. Outside of their $1 billion transfer spree, of course, which they insist is a viable long-term play. CEO Chris Juracek has been tasked with exactly this. Overseeing an increase in food and ticket prices at Stamford Bridge, a rise in kit prices at the club shop, and scrapping the coach subsidy scheme that had been in place for over a decade. The last step was condemned by the Chelsea Supporters Trust, who called it penny-pinching in a cost-of-living crisis. Chelsea highlighted that fewer than 200 people use the service, and that Luton Town were the only other Premier League club to subsidise travel. For the full story, read Simon's piece on The Athletic.